Go out to Jack's Farming Adventure. Today, we're picking vegetables to help other people. We're rocking it out for goodness. Hi, I'm Joel with Shining Light Garden. We're a growing and giving ministry. Everything we grow here, we give away to the needy, the pantries, seniors, children. Um, we're 100% giveaway and 100% volunteer. We need help. If you got a heart for giving and a love for growing, we got a place for you. Today, we are going to be picking and help harvest sweet potatoes and beets. Oh my gosh, I'm excited. Are you excited? Let's do it. Welcome. Today, we are volunteering out at Shining Light Garden in Vero Beach, and today we're harvesting red beets. So it's a very um, no, easy process. You find a red beet, the stem, and you pull it out from the ground. And on the end, you should have a red beet. Wow. Now today, we are harvesting. And as you can see, all of this greenery on top without a red stem, these are all weeds. Weeds, lots of weeds. These are weeds. And what happens is when we have such an overabundance of weeds in the garden, it stifles the growth of the vegetable. This red beet should have been about the size of a baseball or tennis wow. ball. And because of all the amount of weeds, they were stifled in their growth. So we're hoping to get a few good ones. This is why it's so important to have volunteers to come out here. So we'd like to invite you out. Let's organize some groups and come on out and let's do something great for the community at the Shining Light Garden, which is a not-for-profit that helps feed those in the community. So going in this dirt mound, look, and then just kind of digging around. Look at that. Sweet potatoes, guys. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. So that's not in half, but you could still absolutely use that and eat that. Look at little baby ones all different sizes and kind of digging around right look at that oh my gosh look at this one how cool is that so cool what you found found a bunch of tomatoes Those i mean are awesome. there's just the little like there's these little red roots connected to them they go down and you right. just pull one and then you're like you dig to where it went and then you find a bunch of tomatoes. You find them. we got a whole bunch, right? Yeah. You guys are doing an awesome job. Look at them. we got piles and piles of them. So what are you doing now? Pulling your geese with the Caribbean squash. So why are you doing that? Because he's got to mow this up. Plant something new. Plant something new. You guys are doing good things, man. Wow, that's awesome. That's huge. And that's going in the bucket? Awesome. Are you going to take it? Yeah. I had a bigger one. What? Well, that's Everybody's working hard. Okay, this is part of the irrigation system where water comes out and hydrates the plants. We do have a lot of weeds in here, but looking close, because you pick one of these, and this is pretty small, but look at that beet. Get anybody? Yep. Let me see them. Are you snapping them? Boop. Lots of hard workers, guys. People putting their hands together. Jack found the jackpot. Jack found the jackpot. You gonna get those, bud? Get those sweet potatoes. Go get a, put them in a pile, okay? Deal? Do you guys think you're too young to help people? No way. What did you do today with your two hands? Pick potatoes. Like just a few or a lot? A lot. Holy cow! Can you guys show me some? <gasps> that is awesome. You guys did such a good job, and you helped too, bud, right? Wow, look at your hands. I love it. Rock and roll. You guys did such a great job. Thanks for coming out, guys. You got some eggplant? Look at that. Oh, my gosh. And that came from this garden? Yes, ma'am. Wow. Let me check it. So cool, dude. That's 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 crazy. So this goes to people in our community, right, guys? Look at all that beautiful food. So we're super excited to be part of something that is so much bigger than us, helping out with our two hands to pick vegetables and help is needed throughout the course of the year because it goes right back to families in our community. How cool is that? So wherever you live, what kind of opportunities can you have to help other people out? Because I'll tell you, it's super awesome. Do you like this week's episode of Jack's Learning Adventures? What should they do, Jack? Subscribe. And what else? Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Have a great day, guys, and no adventure. It's all